Photograph, a picture painted by the sun without instruction in art, politics, a strife of interests masquerading as a contest of principles. The conduct of public affairs for private advantage, corporation, an ingenious device for obtaining profit without individual responsibility, logic, the art of thinking and reasoning in strict accordance with the limitations and incapacities of the human misunderstanding, history is an account, mostly false, of events, mostly unimportant, which are brought about by rulers, mostly knaves, and soldiers, mostly fools, who never doubted, never half believed. Where doubt is, their truth is, it is her shadow, we know what happens to people who stay in the middle of the road. They get run over, there are four kinds of homicide, felonious, excusable, justifiable, and praiseworthy, happiness, an agreeable sensation arising from contemplating the misery of another, beauty, and the power by which a woman charms a lover and terrifies a husband. The hardest tumble a man can make is to fall over his own bluff. Death is not the end. There remains the litigation over the estate. What this country needs, what every country needs occasionally is a good hard bloody war to revive the vice of patriotism on which its existence as a nation depends, litigation, a machine which you go into as a pig and come out of as a sausage, all are lunatics, but he who can analyze his delusions is called a philosopher. Future. That period of time in which our affairs prosper, our friends are true and our happiness is assured, coward, one who, in a perilous emergency, thinks with his legs, prejudice, a vagrant opinion without visible means of support. Faith, belief without evidence in what is told by one who speaks without knowledge, of things without parallel, painting, and the art of protecting flat surfaces from the weather, and exposing them to the critic, education, and that which discloses to the wise and disguises from the foolish their lack of understanding, conservative, and a statesman who is enamored of existing evils, as distinguished from the liberal who wishes to replace them with others, in our civilization, and under our republican form of government, Intelligence is so highly honored that it is rewarded by exemption from the cares of office, curiosity, and an objectionable quality of the female mind. The desire to know whether or not a woman is cursed with curiosity is one of the most active and insatiable passions of the masculine soul. Optimism, the doctrine or belief that everything is beautiful, including what is ugly, forgetfulness, a gift of God bestowed upon debtors in compensation for their destitution of conscience, the gambling known as business looks with austere disfavor upon the business known as gambling, calamities are of two kinds, misfortunes to ourselves, and good fortune to others, perseverance, a lowly virtue whereby mediocrity achieves an inglorious success, abstainer, a weak person who yields to the temptation of denying himself a pleasure, doubt, indulged and cherished, is in danger of becoming denial, but if honest, and bent on thorough investigation, it may soon lead to full establishment of the truth. The small part of ignorance that we arrange and classify we give the name of knowledge, insurance, an ingenious modern game of chance in which the player is permitted to enjoy the comfortable conviction that he is beating the man who keeps the table, experience, the wisdom that enables us to recognize in an undesirable old acquaintance the folly that we have already embraced, an egotist is a person of low taste, more interested in himself than in me, architect. One who drafts a plan of your house, and plans a draft of your money, edible, ADJ, good to eat, and wholesome to digest, as a worm to a toad, a toad to a snake, a snake to a pig, a pig to a man, and a man to a worm. Telephone, N. An invention of the devil which abrogates some of the advantages of making a disagreeable person keep his distance, 
Patriotism. Combustible rubbish ready to the torch of anyone ambitious to illuminate his name, immortality, a toy which people cry for, and on their knees apply for, dispute, contend and lie for, and if allowed would be right proud eternally to die for, eulogy. Praise of a person who has either the advantages of wealth and power, or the consideration to be dead, a total abstainer is one who abstains from everything but abstention, and especially from inactivity in the affairs of others.